Well, we continue to monitor the Caribbean for showers and thunderstorms here, but I'll tell you what, uh, nothing looks terribly organized to me, and I'm starting to think it's not going to happen here. Uh, yesterday, we had a cluster of thunderstorms off the Nicaragua and Honduras coasts. But notice what's going on today. You have several different clusters. One here in the Southwest Caribbean, another off the Nicaragua, Honduran coast, and another area here across uh, uh, Hispaniola, or I should say uh, south of uh, Cuba and also Jamaica. To me, I think the window has been lost for this to develop here. Let me show you what's going on. Water vapor loop. Again, there, there's not a lot of dry air in and around this system. You see a lot of moisture denoted by the yellow, although you're starting to see a little more dry air now. You see this little area here? Uh, the bigger areas of dry air are well off to the east and well off to the west. So there is sufficient moisture here, but what's really hurting this system or preventing development, I think, is wind shear. Here's our wind shear product here. Where you see the dark purple, this is where you have the strongest wind shear. The lightest wind shear is in uh, the light purple. I, you know, you do have some light wind shear near the Nicaragua and Honduras coast, but here's what's happening is you get showers and thunderstorms that form here. They're forced northward into this strong shear. Wind winds out of the west and nothing can develop. So at this point, I think there's a very low chance we get development here. I just don't think the wind shear is going to allow for it. There's too much wind shear. Now listen, you have to keep an eye on it. I personally think the window shuts here uh, as we get toward tomorrow. If it hasn't developed by tomorrow, late tonight and tomorrow, I don't think it's going to. Listen, we'll continue to watch it. Nonetheless, you have a lot of moisture going up into Cuba, Jamaica, and Hispaniola, and there could be some locally heavy rain and flush flooding, so we have to keep an eye on that.